is up awesome people and welcome back to my Pokemon trading card game online card opening series alrighty so in the last episode we had a really good um, pull of oh, luck of the draw I suppose you can call it uh, with Pokemon black and white noble victories with pulled um, two full arts as well as a few hollows that are quite rare at the same time so I'm going to quickly load up the um, Noble Victories deck that we've got so far and just show off a few Pokemon. So our first card that we drew of noticed was Verizian Full Art. Um, and yeah, I, I went through and said, um, I didn't actually expect too much of this card at first glance, looking at Leaf, Leaf Wallop. But reading its effect, I then went, holy crap, that's actually a really good um, card. With no exception, um, mostly Full Art cards are quite strong. Uh, Victini Hollow was another mention, I suppose. Um, then we've got Full Art Terrican. Now this was a really strong card. Um, as I said, you can use the Retaliate and Switch card method on Reter uh, Terrican. And as I said, a lot of cards do not usually carry 90 health if they're not fully evolved or even evolved. Um, so a lot of cards will go down to one hit for that one. And if not retaliate, Land Crush will definitely hurt and take out a lot of Pokemon at the same time, unless they're fully evolved and sitting at full health at the same time. Right, so it's a few of the cards that we pulled that are of mention. Um, oh, there's one. Landris, hollow. Alright, so Landris, um, this, this Pokemon hurt quite a lot, um, especially with Guy Hammer. But I did say if you had a, um, if this was the only Pokemon on your side of the field, you can really just spam Guy Hammer, and then just before it goes down, you can just send a Pokemon from your hand to the bench, and then just let Vandras die or switch it out or just something. But just spam Guy Hammer while as kind of a last resort move, because you really don't be using that and then knocking out your own benched Pokemon and having your opponent pick up prize cards. Alrighty, so were there any other Pokemon of mention? I do not remember an Cobaline. Yes, there was. This was the last one. Uh, so Cobaline, um, Iron Breaker, really. Oh well, I can kind of claim that call that like a game-breaking move. Um, a damage and stops the opposing Pokemon being able to attack the next turn. So ouch. So if that just kept spamming that move, then really the opponent really can't do anything unless it's got. A card that can stop that, or a perky body or perky ability that stops all type of these effects. So, yeah, I can see that move being spammed quite a lot when it's on the field. So, anyways, um, let's get on to opening these booster packs. I've still got 12 of these left. I started with 19. We kind of slowed down a little bit with all the great pulls as well. So, hopefully, we can keep up the great pulls and actually get through all of these. Um, so, we're starting off with La Vesta, Time Pol uh, Tynamo. Dino, Pansia, Perniad, uh, then we're looking at Garbodor, Amoongus, Tortorga, um, then we've got a Reverse Hollow Electros, and a Victini Alternative Art, and the funny thing is the other one was Fire, this one is Psychic, which I don't really know why that happens, but um, that one can be a Hollow at the same time. Right, so that was our first pull. Second pull, we've got Yam Mask, Levesta, Swaddle, Litwick, Blitzel, uh, that one is Zwellius, um, got another one of those fossils, Minshaw, then we've got a Reverse Hollow, um, oh, it's not Gigalith, it's one before it, Boulder. And finally we've got Verizian, who is unfortunately not hollow, but that one can be, I think it is hollow, it is too, sweet, we've got a hollow, Verizian, so so we got the full art and the hollow for it. That's that's really sweet. Anyways, moving on, we've got an Elegam, Swaddle, another Tynamo, Dino, another Yam Mask, um, Swadloon, another one of those fossils. Um, we've got an Everlight, which works on similar to how it works in the game as well. It does half the amount of damage dealt to a non-evolved Pokemon, and we've got a excuse me, a Reverse Hollow, Amoongus, and another. Oh, excuse me, um, I had a bit of a drink before this and it's starting to really kick back on me. Um, and a hollow Cobaloin. Another one. Sweetness. Alrighty, so we've got nine left. So next, we've got Shelmet, um, Solus, another Yam Mask, Aksu, Vanillite, Archon, Palpatode, Heatmore, which is awesome. And we've got a reverse hollow Terrican. 
and a Reunculus, which is not hollow. Right, next we have Perniad, then we've got a Golurt, Stunkfisk, Frillish, Dino, Everlight, oh I need to start learning these fossils, um, Rocky Helmet, Yarn Mask, which is Reverse Hollow, and another Reunculus. Are you hollow or not? No, you're not. Right, so up next we have Shelmet, uh, Dwebble, Litwick, Fungus, uh, Yarn Mask. Uh, are you Max Transceiver or not? Can't remember this one. Um, Fraxor, Lampet, Reverse Hollow, Vanillite, and Palpitoad. No, Seismitoad, sorry. Uh, you're not hollow either. Radio, so we've got six left. Come on, we've got to get lucky six. There's got to be something good coming. Alright, so in this one, we've got Litwick, Blitzel, Swaddle, Stumpfisk, Carablast, Everlight, Cryogonal, Swadloon, Reverse Hollow, Elegum, and are you hollow? Um, you are. Um, 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 um. Big mind blank. Um, sorry, I'll come back to your name. I'll think of it when I'm looking at you. <laughs> oh, well, I'm terrible with names. You've not picked up. Um, up next, we've got Frillish, Pansir, Timber, Tynamo, Axu, uh, Crustle, Durant, Swedloon, Reverse Hollow, Archon, and another non hollow, Excelga. So I'm not getting quite lucky with these hollows over here. Then again, I suppose it is kind of making up for the hollows I've already scored. Radio, so this time around we're getting Elegum, um, Patil, Stumpfisk, Litwick, Elegum, another Everlight. I've got quite a lot of these now. Um, Electrike, Bishop, uh, Reverse Hollow, X Transceiver. I think that's what it's called. I think that's what the card is anyway. And another one of these, which I can't think of its name at this point in time. But I love when it happens. Alrighty oh, so we got Litwick, Perniad, Trubish, Carablast, Waddle, Cryogonal, Heatmore, Tortuga, Palpito, Reverse Hollow, and a Hollow Haxorus. So that is that is really sweet actually. Alrighty, oh, so two left. Two left. Alrighty, so this time we got Pansia, Time Pole, Carablast, Tynamo, Stumpfisk, Amolga. Durant, Archon, Reverse Hollow, Bishop, and a Victini. Another Victini. That's three Victinis for this set. That's an awful lot of Victinis. Um, I think Victini is actually the mascot for this one, so that may explain why there's so many Victinis. Right, so last one. And this one, we are pulling a Carablast, Pansia, Elegum, Vanillite, Patil, Swellius, Crustle, Heatmore, Reverse Hollow, Gerda, and finally, a Cryogonal. Right, so that was our last booster pack. So let's head back over here, and I think we're already on the field, so for no victories we are. So we've now got two Hollow Cobaloins, so let's quickly have a look. We have what I think is a Hollow Bishop, no, it's a Reverse Hollow Bishop. Um, then we've got a Archon, Reverse Hollow Archon. Sorry, the Reverse Hollow is there. Um, Amoongus, Reverse Hollow, Excelga, Zwellius, Yam Mask, um, Alternative Art, Reverse Hollow, Yam Mask, Full Art Verizian, which we've already seen, and then Hollow Verizian. Same moves as the Full Art version, just this one's a lot cooler and a lot rarer at the same time. Uh, there's our Alternative Art, Victini, same time as the Psychic Time, not the Fire Type. Alternative Art, Victini and a hollow alternative art Victini as well. So as you can see, there's the three Victinis for this series. Um, that's the reverse... No, that's not the reverse. That's reverse hollow Velonite. Oh, they keep switching around. That's annoying. Um, Vanilla Sh... Um, Tynamo, the alternative art Tynamo. Time Pole, Trubish, Torturga, Timber, um, Hollow Terrican. There's the full art Terrican, so same moves as the full art version, same thing again, that one's a lot rarer. Swadloon, Stumpfisk, alternative art Stumpfisk, same time, they're different types. Solar, Simiseer, Shelmet, Swaddle, semi, um, Seismic Toad, not hollow unfortunately. Reunculus, alternative art Reunculus, Patil, and reverse hollow Ponid, um, alternative art Ponid. Pansir, Palpitoid, Reverse Hollow, 
And then normal Palpatode. Oh, uh, there's our Hollow Landris. All right, this is the other Pokemon I wanted to look at. Was Hollow Haxorus. Now this was one I remember getting as well. Um, 140 health. It's a normal type. This was before the Dragon type was introduced into the game. Um, it's got Dual Chop, which is 50 times for damage. Requires two of any energy cards. Flip two coins. This attack does 50 damage times the number of heads. So if you get one times, does 50, does get two heads, it gives 100. And its last move is Giga Impact, very similar to how it works in the game as well. This Pokemon cannot attack during your next turn, deals 120 damage, and requires three of any energy cards to be able to use it. So we've got a Reverse Holo Girder, Golet, Reverse Holo Gigalith, and another Gigalith. I'm pretty sure this one can be um, hollow at the same time, unless I'm thinking of another series. Garbodor, Frillish, Fraxor, Fungus, Excavior. That's the one I was thinking of. It's got two of these. This is the Trommy twice. Amolga, Elegum, Reverse Hollow Elegum, Electros, Electrike, Redurant, as well as Reverse Hollow Durant. I'm starting to think I'm going back to the beginning. Um, Reverse Hollow Cryogonal, plus another one. Alternative Art, Cryogonal, Crustle. Now, I got this one before I even started this series, so. Show sure we didn't pull this one on screen, but I think this one was given to you. Um, why can't I view it? That's bizarre. Huh, I can't view it. Um, but yeah, that was given um, as like a default deck when you started the game. So anyways, um, that's it for this episode. So in the next episode, I'll either be doing live redeems um, or just doing a lot of redeeming off screen and just pulling the decks that I get from those codes. I'm not quite too sure what I'm going to do, um, but yeah, when I figure it out, I'll do a whatever I figure out I'm going to be doing. So anyways, um, this is Lady Crimson saying ciao for now, but not forever. Ciao!